life is about ripening. You ripen and you can't ripen at all anything unless you have gone through it and you know, you fully developed that within you, you know. Um, so talk about, having said that, if you want me to talk more about narcissists, which we can't avoid the subject matter if we're interested in life on Earth, period. Okay, so narcissism. I'm here to change the language. Make it understandable. Stop the hocus pocus. That's what the narcissist wants. It's, <laughs> gaslight the whole fucking thing. Everything's get gaslit. Um, to save themselves. Save really what? What? Who? Because it's never any one person. If you um, notice, if you're super sensitive and you're just to patternings and stuff, you'll see that every, they're the same. See, I um, notice, um, you know, there's different flavors, so, but you'll find that they're all the same. It could be an older woman in their 60, 60s, millionaire, or your brother that's your age. They both are very different, and they can even hate each other. They're the one, ones capable of hate, by the way. They find their enemies with what, who? Their own kind. And that's why you want to get away from them, because they'll turn all of that around on you. And the only reason how they're able to do that is because they're, they are non-self-reflecting. And they're looking for you to be responsible. It really is... Well, it's it's that, but it also it's masking in that I can't be found out that I am negligent to the fucking marrow. And this is what's out there running things, making a ton of money and masking and and, and sitting and, and just saying it doesn't matter. Two plus two is five. See, there's where, I mean, as somebody who is trying to remain intelligent, um, have my own intelligence, like say, maybe I played music and I saw saw that math and I was like looking at these vibrational frequencies and it's kind of, oh, that's easy. And boy, when you're, when you're working musically, uh, you can, you can move mountains, right? That's the truth. I mean, that's what you do. I mean, if you want, if you're running a factory or something, you are best... Um, to be looking into your quality production by putting music on and make it classical music, no words. Every once in a while, ask them, is there something you want to listen to and bring it in? But a lot of people won't agree. But the thing is, is it's because it's consciousness. And, and so, but, but never, ever subject anybody to pop country Western music. That is equal to a fucking fluoride hit, and you want them to commit suicide? The, the workplace is hard enough. Just play that shit if you hate them. You don't want them to ever come back after a few weeks. You want to keep them with a stomach ache. <laughs> anyway, you know, just stay away from pop, modern day pop country western. Don't even, I mean, even if the, vo the voices are taken out, don't listen to the music. It's not really music. As a musician, get the fuck out of there. That's like, if you want to look at the math that they're doing, it's like, can we get out of the the plus minus scenario? Because life is so much more complicating than that. And getting hung up on, you got hung up on your relationship. Just play that. Sorry, I'm going on and on about that now. Here's a, here's a joke. Um, if, if the only right way to listen to country western music is to play it backwards because then you will regain your land back. Your wife will not leave you. Your dog will come home and you'll be walking backwards. You won't eat from the bar. You won't, you know, you will be sober then. <laughs> anyway, back to what, is, what am I fuming about? Boy, there's a lot of energy and I can't see. I'm the type that can't stay. I'm a healer. 
And I, I say that in this fucking living hell that we're living in in this world. I am wounded. Nobody agrees. And it's like, well, fuck you. I'm healing myself. That's what I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm not healing you. And I'm certainly not going to blow sunshine up your ass anytime soon. Take it or leave it. As far as the entertainment system here, which is not being used right. It's sad. It's been lost, like I said in my last video. It's interesting to think that to live in denial and block things out. You know, I mean, I understand to focus on other things, but see, even Abraham Hicks says, you indulge in the neg negative thoughts and the scenarios that could, may, might happen for 16 seconds only. And the same with, also, your most extreme, beautiful thoughts, the thing you want. You think about it, concentrate, and then you discard it. How, why? That's the way you're going to let it be. And that's the way you're going to let it be. I mean, and, and, and so, but there's other methods, right, that they teach about how to um, uh, focus on, on being that which you want to attract and it's like you know what <sighs> that's 90 percent of the people's or the, the abused population who um has been disenfranchised as as disenfranchised at a very early age by other people around them that didn't know better who's saying no 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 and now the universe looks like a no and they're struggling and they don't just have the sense of boy we have it and look what we can do and let's celebrate you know there's that and it's like I'm on my high flying disc already. Uh, no, when, see the the narcissist. And I, I would like to wrap this up to tell you the truth. Fuck this subject matter. But really, like I said, um, you can't skip over this subject matter because what is it? It's just concern for about the conditions that has been set up um, uh, for us by the human mind that is not being looked at. It's the blind human mind, which is fear. What is it? Well, well, it's just blind. What it is, it's the awareness that's not there about the mind who knows that this is the, the true nature of the mind. It is fear. Why? Well, because if you ever um, gave it authority over you, you know, first of all, it's, it has no connection with reality. It's just a memory bank. And now it's like, oh, oh really? I'm the boss now? Well, shit, pff, I, can't, I can't even see. So, so actually, here, let me get this load of shit. It's like a spool of toilet paper that comes out, but it's not clear. It's not reality. It's religion. And, and, and you see the way that people work out there when they do their jobs and stuff? It's like they have a clipboard, and it's like, would you shut up? You know, if you knew a little bit better, see, I come from Freemason um, people. My grandmother, she knew how to do things with her hands, and 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 my great grandpa knew everything. He can he can machine every anything and everything. He invented things. So you don't tell this person. You don't pull a wool over your eyes and say, "Well, the elevator can't go all the way to the top because of this and that." It's like bullshit. Figure out a way and do it right the first time, so you don't ever have to do it again. That's, I, I'm, you know, fuming about it, and everybody should be, and there's a lot of people that are um, sitting there with their intellectual property being stolen out from under them, and their IQs being sucked out because 80% of the population is um, not in connection with that. They're just hands slapped out, and now it's just this, ah, ah, no, you, no, you, and it's like, good fucking God. Meanwhile, our lives are being destroyed. When I say our lives, babe, I'm saying reality. Reality. Everything that we can talk about the possibility of our lives being here, like say Christ, what did Christ sacrifice herself for? Still a mystery and who that was, and it doesn't make sense that they're saying it's a man. Not, not, not at all. Not at all. That's like wah, 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 wah. Good job. Missed the point again. And I'm not sitting here saying bias. It's because women are superior. No, it's because we're being ignored. 
and you're ignoring or whoever the fucking organism is or whatever is is organizing people to focus in such a way which is hideous because it comes through the entertainment system and, and you look at it and you see it's like okay wait a minute now it's it is like okay so you're at school and then and then they start teaching a different way and it's like oh pr pretty soon it's like wait a minute now, I, 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 and and uh, that really talk about the mandala effect or whatever but see this is also what's happening with your television set that that's the adult the, the continuation schools, adult babysitting surface, in case you thought education was on to something, continue listening to and, and being fed by this shit. And um, it's a wall, man. It's just this frequency producing where people, you know, it, it's 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 taking over the mind. Like I said, it takes their real, the space away, the infinite space. The, see, us masters will not tell you directly very often what reality really is. We want you to go for it. I mean, even this is very vague. It's an infinite space. Just beyond your nose, right in between here and here. A lot of people don't consider the space. I call it outer space, the final frontier. Everybody's concerned about the fifth dimension, but they never even graduated themselves into the third dimension. It's outer space. Will they ever? We don't know. 80% has still yet to get it. We can't trust them as far as we can spit because they don't allow that space to anybody either. You know, But they don't know that... You can't take that away from anybody. You can put their minds in front of them. And you can be a mind and you can all get together and hold each other and say, yeah, two plus two, it is five. Two plus two, shut up, Billy. Here, take this pill. <laughs> Sickening!